That Ocho Rios dock is still closed. Carnival clarifies that scooter policy. And another dry dock cruise news today starts now. From the Cruise Radio Studio in Jacksonville, Florida, this is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Tuesday, March 12th. That cruise pier in Jamaica remains out of service. MSC Cruises has informed passengers aboard the MSC Seascape of an itinerary change for its Jamaican port of call due to dock damage that happened in Ocho Rios during a bad storm in February. A statement from MSC says, quote, due to extensive pier damage caused by a recent incident involving another cruise ship at the port in Ocho Rios, Jamaica's Port Authority has advised us that Berth 2 will remain closed for repairs at least until May. Now, despite the port changes, MSC ships can still go to Jamaica, just stopping at Falmouth and Ocho Rios. Other cruise lines, such as NCL and Carnival, have also changed cruise itineraries. And Carnival Cruise Line recently faced some backlash after announcing stricter enforcement of their mobility scooter guidelines aboard their ships, particularly the Excel class ships like Mardi Gras. Brand Ambassador John Heald clarified that scooters are allowed as long as they can safely fit through the cabin doors and are not left in the corridors or public areas, which could hinder evacuation procedures and impede cabin attendance. The enforcement includes measuring scooters at check-in and offering alternatives for guests whose scooters don't comply, such as renting an appropriate model at the pier or just rebooking their cruise. Heald went on to say that these same policies also apply to oversized strollers and wagons, stressing the need for safety and accessibility on board. And Royal Caribbean's Radiance of the Seas has entered a dry dock in Freeport, Bahamas. Now, during this two-week dry dock, the ship will undergo maintenance and a refresh of its public spaces. Radiance will head to Tampa following the dry dock before repositioning to Vancouver to sail north and southbound cruises between Vancouver, Canada and Seward, Alaska. And cruise line stocks were mixed on Monday. Carnival Corporation down 1%, 16.22. Royal Caribbean up slightly, 127.80. And Norwegian down 1%, 19.80. If you have a lead on a story, drop us a line, tips at cruiseradio.net. Have yourself a great Tuesday. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today.